The city is served by the Atlanta Police Department, which numbers 2,000 offices and oversaw a 40% decrease in the city's crime rate between 2001 and 2009. Specifically, homicide decreased by 57%, rape by 72% and violent crime overall by 55%. Crime is down across the country. But Atlanta's improvement has occurred at more than twice the national rate. Nevertheless, Forbes ranked Atlanta as the sixth most dangerous city in the United States in 2012. Aggravated assaults, burglaries and robberies were down from 2014. Mexican drug cartels thrive in Atlanta. 145 gangs operate in Atlanta. The Atlanta Fire Rescue Department provides fire protection and first responder emergency medical services to the city from its 35 fire stations. In 2017, AFRD responded to over 100,000 calls for service over a coverage area of 135. 7 square miles, 351, 5 square kilometers. The department also protects Hartsfield-Jackson with five fire stations on the property, serving over 1 million passengers from over 100 countries. The department protects over 3,000 high-rise buildings, 23 miles, 37 kilometers, of the rapid rail system and 60 miles, 97 kilometers, of Interstate Highway. Emergency ambulance services are provided to city residents by hospital-based grade EMs, Fulton County, and American Medical Response, DeKalb County. Atlanta in January 2017 declared the city was a welcoming city, and will remain open and welcoming to all. Nonetheless, Atlanta does not consider itself to be a sanctuary city. Atlanta Mayor Keisha Lance Bottoms said, Our city does not support ICE. We don't have a relationship with the U.S. Marshal S. Service. We closed our detention center to ICE detainees. And we would not pick up people on an immigration violation. Quote.